There are two programmes which are based in here. We have an undergraduate operating department practice programme. Uh, one part of the course is run here and also it's parallel run in Ormskirk as well. So the students are on placements within the Manchester area who are based here at St James's. The undergraduate BSc Honours Paramedic Practice Programme is based here at St James as well and all our placements are supported around the North West region. The courses are structured uh, in weekly blocks so students will spend a, a large proportion of time here in, at St James's undertaking their theory, whether it's face to face or online. And the other element, uh, the students are out on practice as well. So both courses are structured 50-50 with 50% of time in clinical practice and 50% of the time in university. The help desk at St James also provides us support from an admin sort of aspect. Also, if we have any uh, learning needs or any skills, they can point us in the right direction. They also help with uh, facilitating the access to the course, emails. Um, generally, if there's something that the lecturer can't help with, they normally able to help. We have a number of staff based here at St James's for both the ODP programme and also the Paralympic programme. And these, are, these staff are specialists in their field of expertise. With extensive experience with working in the NHS and private settings, in operating theatres, within the ambulance service. And the offices are next door to the classrooms and students have good access to the tutors throughout their studies. Here at St James we have a, a range of different facilities to support students learning. It's a very bespoke site so we have two undergraduate programmes based here, our permanent programme and our operating department practice programme. We have a bespoke library which is the resources are specific to health professional programmes. Students can also access resources from the main Ormskirk library as well and books can be transported down for students should they need them. We have two undergraduate programmes based in Manchester and these are central to the region and these are complemented by the placement environment which is around the Greater Manchester area. Our paramedic students will have access to placements around Greater Manchester and across the North West. Our operating department practice students based in Manchester will have their placements around the Greater Manchester area. We have a number of classrooms at St James and these are all installed with high-tech equipment to ensure that we can record lectures and capture these and then post these online afterwards so students can recap the learning at the end of the day when they go home. We have a range of high fidelity resources to support students learning in the clinical skills and simulation suite, inclusive of a mock ambulance, we have an operating department table, anaesthetic equipment, surgical equipment to support students in developing themselves with a close contact and facilitation from our tutors who've got expertise in that area. Students can practice their skills, demonstrate their knowledge, demonstrate their understanding with a close support by the tutors in a safe and supportive environment and this both enhances their confidence and competence in their knowledge and skills. So the Clinical Skills Lab is, is, is very good for our learning. Um, the reason is because um, they have uh, lifelike dummies that will respond to different commands. We've also, with cannulation, we're able to see real blood flow in the arm. We are to see veins, which allows us to, to practice cannulation. We've also got um, the dummies that we can insert eye gels and um, intubation techniques with the real life tools gives us the ability to see realistically what we'd be doing in, on the road. Lecturers on both programmes are very current in clinical practice and still work in clinical practice to maintain their credibility and expertise to then support students with their areas of specialism. There's a mock ambulance set up there inside the actual clinical skills lab. Their ability to go inside it and to see how the setup is, is done and the different drawers and the different ways that it's presented gives us an idea of what it's to be like on the road when we go on the road to do these uh, ambulance placements.
For our programmes based here at St James's, so our undergraduate operating departments practice programme and our undergraduate paramedic practice programme, placements are inclusive as part of the course overall. Students will spend the vast amount of their time in what we call a hub placement and that's their main area of speciality. So our ODP students spend the majority of time within the operating theatres, supervised, supported by clinical practice mentors. Our paramedic students will spend the majority of their time in the ambulance placement setting, again supervised and supported by specialists in that particular field. Students also have the opportunity to experience other areas of health and social care setting learning as well. This may include uh, placements in different areas such as accident and emergency within the community, the intensive care unit, uh, mental health placements, all to support their learning in the, in the specialist area uh, of their programmes. Whilst on their theory block, students will undertake an average of 37 and a half hours per week at university. And this is through a variety of approaches, which can include online learning and online study, either face-to-face -face via an online platform, or through uh, asynchronous activities, which can include other resources, and then collaborate sessions where students can get together with tutors and each other to discuss certain aspects of that subject topic. For face-to-face -face sessions, students will be in the classroom setting, it could be within the classroom face-to-face -face, or with our clinic, within our clinical skills and simulation suite as well, undertaking realistic practical skills under the supervision of tutors with that specialist area of expertise. Students are assessed via a variety of means. Uh, they, we have written assignments which students complete and submit online. We have presentations. These can be undertaken face-to-face -face or submitted online. We also have written examinations. We have what we call obstru objective structured clinical examinations where students will be assessed on a practical skill uh, observed by the tutor and assessed by the tutor face-to-face -face within our clinical skills and simulation suite. At St James we have two student social areas where students can meet, meet with their friends, meet with their peers, discuss aspects of the course, discuss how placements have been and also relax in between lectures as well. The, the two student facility areas, um, for maybe for relaxing or for, for doing work, um, you've got the small area where you can get your drinks, your coffees, your snacks, have a sit down, have a chat, um, then you've got a more relaxed area where there's a bigger area where you can meet, there's got a kitchen, um, you've got microwave access, hot water, um, you're able to bring your own food in or you know get food from local facilities.